Hello everyone, this is Stevio here. We are playing on our Custom Crew series here. And boy, am I excited for today. We got a chopping contract. So we have 160 acres to chop for our dairy. I'm really excited. So let's go over our equipment here quickly. We got a Peterbilt. 389 Peterbilt. Boy, does this thing look fancy. Man, I love that paint scheme on this Peterbilt. Of course, we got a road track case tractor 500. Guess what we're going to be doing with this, of course. Leveling out that silage and packing it. We've got a uh, heavy hauler trailer. We got two other Peterbilt 389s here. And they are going to be pulling you know what the choppers so we got four FR 780 choppers here New Hollands with nine foot heads and we got some C 500 Kenworth's heavy duties and these boys will be keeping up with these choppers they have a Bergman chopper box on the back and a bowl guard in the front and they should easily get through all that mud and gunk in the field we also have squads truck here f-250 pulling the of course fuel trailer so let's get these boys on the road first we have to load up our choppers get in our old peterbilts Back this boy up nice and easy. Just like, uh, shut that off quickly. Let it warm up just a bit. So look at these girls go. So we got our silage compactor going there. Here comes the first two choppers. Looks like one of the choppers got a little hairy there. Hopefully he stays on. Our next two choppers are coming up. They look like they have made the trip faring better should have some of our semis coming up here we go here's the first c500 coming down the road first girl on the coal second girl coming by third girl fourth girl looks like squad's truck is right behind in our service truck so our compactor is pulling in now slow down buddy take that turn nice and easy bit too far ahead
we are pulling these trucks around here. Get all these silage trucks a moving. Trying to make this nice and neat. Take our service truck over here. Move squad's truck over. We'll leave squad's truck over here by the service truck. Shut that off. Got to shut off the service truck here. First old workhorse C500. Pull over to the side here. Move this third girl out of the way. Always forget to shut these off. Move this last girl out of the way. So, there you have it, folks. The convoy is back. The best part is that's not everything. We still got more equipment to get to this field. So that was only half of the equipment. We still got these tractors. So we're going to split this 160 acre field in half. So that way half of it's going to go to the dairy farm and half of it the dairy farm wants to sell to a co-op. So we're going to have two choppers running at the same time on different fields so four total two on each field so these are going to be running into our silo and we're going to be compacting it the other trucks are going to be running it to the feed barn where they're going to sell the silage so let's get these girls over to the farm so here's the first girl coming around There she goes. Second one's going. Third. Man, that blue New Holland T8s just look great with these silage wagons here. Really match the DB50s three wheel, three axle silage wagons. We're going along here. We had to road these tractors, but it's not a huge deal. We don't have to go that far. Get them going down the road. These tractors go at a good clip, 31 mile an hour. You can't hardly load these tractors and strap them down and run the truck at 50 mile an hour you still want to probably beat it I know the roading is harder on the wheels but we're just decided to road these so like I said these four will be dumping into the silo and the other four will be selling the silage on the northern part of the field Watch these girls go by one more time. And the last girl. We'll jump on into her. Making good time. We're about two thirds of the way there. Start this silage team.
So it looks like we got some cotton over here. It's weird the map author didn't take cotton out. The base game being it's uh, Ohio region that we got this. So here over to our left is where I first built about the middle of that field there. I f my first farmyard here in Ohio I built on this Midwest horizon map. Here we're coming up on our dairy farm. Looks like we got some weeds over in the fields over here. So let's start a course here. We'll turn this girl right here. So we're going to be filling in both sides of this silo, two in each. Drive right down the center of it. And go over here. We're doing our second course here, and this side will load over here. Hopefully we can keep up with one compacting tractor. So now we got to get these choppers and compactors offloaded. Gotta shut that truck off, always forget. Oh, last 389 Peterbilt. Shut that. Now we need to get our choppers to run in here. First old New Holland startup. Get, we'll start this old girl over here on the side so this is going to this side is going to go into the silo go a little ways into the field there we go Now we got to get our compactor off here. Get this front wing unfolded. Make sure we get him off to the side here so he doesn't get in the way. So when the T8s are unloading, he isn't blocking them. 
So now we gotta set up a course for these semis and get the northern field started here. We're getting this course started, so this is going to be selling at the local feed store up the road here. Farmer got a good crop of corn, doesn't want it all in his silos. These C500 sure roll the coal when they're going by. here and what we have to do is drive it across the scale here or the unload point drive around so the best thing is you don't really want to cross paths like that when you're doing this but we kind of had to because of how we drove up there which is okay, probably shouldn't have too many collisions. So the key is to stay on the right side of the road the best way as possible. So look at that chopper team going there. Looks like they're going good. We're gonna get a lot of silage off of that, just that half a field. Looks like I'm gonna have to help this grow out over here. We're gonna get this, so we'll go right here. No way, got a few loads going into our silos. We really got to get to working. Got to get on into our silage compactor. Look, yep. Looks like they're unloading good in the bins there. Got two loads. Get these last two girls are running in the field here. So we'll end part one of this two-part series here. Come back tomorrow as you see our chopping machines chew up the corn. And I will see you later.